and so today I'm doing a review and giveaway on a one size shopping cart cover. This shopping cart cover comes from JJ Cole Collections and the print is in Aqua Drops. Uh, this is a really nice shopping cart cover. Uh, when I got this in the mail, the first thing that I noticed was the size. Um, I thought that it was really nice that it came in a carrying case and that it was just so small and compact. Um, most shopping cart covers that you see are big and bulky and they kind of get in the way and there's really no nice neat way to fold them up and store them so you kind of end up just tossing them in your back seat uh, of your car and they just kind of look messy and it's not neat or organized and me personally I like to stay neat and organized and um, yeah. So the first thing I noticed was how small it was. This thing is nice and small. You can toss it in your diaper bag. You can put it in the back seat of your car. It's not going to take up a lot of space. If you're not going to use it for a while and you're not having it in your car, you can store it on a shelf in your baby's nursery. Um, so it's not going to take up a lot of space. It's really nice, neat, and compact. You can even carry it into the restaurant or into the, the shopping mall um, with it just like this, and it doesn't look like you're carrying a blanket, uh, like some of the other shopping cart covers um, look like. I have to say, with um, a couple of the other shopping cart covers that I've used in the past, uh, it's a little embarrassing when you walk into a restaurant and you've got this big old shopping cart cover rolled up into a ball because you're trying to carry it in to put on the high chair in the restaurant. Uh, and the one thing with this is you don't have to do that. You don't have to be embarrassed because it looks like you're uh, bringing in a blanket to the restaurant um, when it's all nice and neat and in its own little case. So, when I got it, I decided to go ahead and open it up and look at it, of course, and so when I opened it, what I realized was it's not a carrying case at all. Well, it sort of is, but it's all in, made in one. So, it's sewn together, and this little pocket is actually what the carrying case is. So I thought that was really neat that it folded up and had its own personal carrier carrying case um, and it wasn't something that was separate from the actual cover. So I thought that was really nice. Um, it is uh, got some elastic towards the back where it goes over the back of the cover and the elastic goes all the way around and is, there's only no elastic at the very, very back of it. Now the very front of the cover, like I said, does have the elastic too. And it also has these little rings, and these little rings hold little toys. So you can stick little links on them and put your child's toys on them. Um, one thing I like to put on it is uh, my son's pacifier because that way he can pick it up and put it in his mouth. And if he drops it, it's not going to drop onto the floor in the shopping mall or in the grocery store or um, in the restaurant, so that's really convenient. Another thing that I like is the fact that the belt, the safety belt, is actually attached to the, um, whatever, is actually attached to the cover itself, whereas some shopping cart covers, the belt is completely detachable, and if you're anything like me, and you take that belt off, and you forget to attach it back to the cover, you're going to go out somewhere and you're going to forget it. My main problem was I would wash um, other shopping cart covers and I wouldn't wash the belt because I wouldn't want to mess up the plastic on it. Um, and then I would forget to reattach it to the cover and then I would get going where I was going and I wouldn't have the belt. And then I would wind up having to use the belt from the restaurant or the belt from the shopping cart cover and I thought that was really nasty. So you'll never forget your belt with this because it's attached and it has an adjustment here. So it adjusts really nice. Um, and so it's really nice as far as that goes. It has um, where the where the pocket is, where you actually stuff it, it's just a little padded and um, they kind of sit on that area so that's nice. They have a little padding on the bottom. Now it folds up really nicely. You just turn it inside out and I just shake it down and um, I put the flap towards me and then I just turn the sides in and then I just kind of roll it up all the way and then I hold on to one side and then I just kind of turn it inside out and it folds up 
really quick, really nice, and you're ready to go. So you don't have a lot of hassle when you're trying to put it together. The one thing that I would probably change about this is I would like to see a little bit of cushioning in the back of the cover. And maybe because the shopping carts are uh, really hard, um, usually grocery carts are metal, and if you go to places like Target, they have the plastic carts. Um, but I do find that it's a little hard on their backs. Um, although my son didn't complain and he didn't act like it bothered him. Maybe it's more of something for me to feel more comfortable, uh, that my son feels more comfortable. But yeah, because it's a really thin piece of fabric uh, lined with um, another fabric in the back. But um, that's really the only thing I would change about it. But overall, it's a really nice cover. It is practical because it's small and compact. And it's really cute. It's got a really nice stylish print. And they offer, I think, four other prints than this. Or maybe just three other prints. I can't remember off the top of my head. But they're all nice stylish prints. And um, so, yeah, I think it's really nice. I'm going to put some video clips in here to show you how this fits on a, a shopping cart as well as in uh, a high chair. The regular style wooden high chairs. I know some of the new, new restaurants, or even old restaurants, they're starting to kind of change their high chairs around a little bit. But um, this fits in the older style wooden type high chairs. Uh, I didn't actually try it in any of the other high chairs of the other restaurants. Um, some restaurants like Cracker Barrel, they have a kind of weird high chair. Uh, it's not like your regular normal restaurant style high chair. So um, it wouldn't really work for uh, places like that. But um, I'm going to insert a video of using it in a high chair and in a shopping cart. And uh, yeah, so watch those. And then when you get finished watching those, we'll talk about the giveaway, okay? All right, thanks.
Okay, so a little bit about the giveaway. The giveaway is going to be open to the USA and Canada residents. Um, there are a few things that you have to do in order to enter. You must be a subscriber to my YouTube. And if you're not already a subscriber, you can click the yellow subscribe button in this video. And that will take you to a subscription page. And you can click there and subscribe. Uh, the second thing that you're going to have to do is you have to go to JJ Cole Collections Facebook page and you have to like their Facebook page. Uh, now I'm going to put a link in the down bar and that way you can be directed directly to their Facebook page and you can go ahead and like them. Uh, and one comment you're going to post below, I did the requirements. And you're going to leave me your Facebook name. And you have some ways of getting some extra entries. Um, one extra entry is you can follow JJ Cole Collections on Twitter. Another extra entry is you can sign up for their emailing list. And um, also you can subscribe to their YouTube channel page. And those will give you three extra entries if you do all three. If you only do one, you only get one extra entry. For every extra entry that you do, you're going to put extra entry number one and a comment, extra entry number two and your comment, extra entry number three and your comment, so on and so forth. And um, you can also like video product reviews on Facebook. You can follow the blog of video product reviews. You can follow video product reviews on Twitter. You can share this on Twitter. And you can also share this on Facebook. Now, if you share this on Twitter, you can share it daily. If you share this giveaway daily on Twitter, you will get one extra entry every single day. If you share this on Twitter or on Facebook, I need the permalink. And if you don't know how to provide a permalink, let me know and I'll tell you exactly how to do that. And the permalink needs to be posted on the comments section of my blog. Now all links that you're going to need to enter the giveaway are going to be posted below in the description bar. So go ahead and check those out so you'll know exactly what to do. Uh, if you have any questions about how to enter, just send me a message here through YouTube and I'll make sure that you enter correctly.